To introduce our next category, we once again go to France. This time to a movie set just outside Paris where the projectionist assures us we'll find the enchanting Academy Award winner of Roman Holiday, Miss Audrey Hepburn. The next awards are for the best achievement in costume design. This award is not only of great interest to every actress who depends upon the artistry of the designer to help her create her role, but it is also important to women throughout the world. Historical or modern, every film with beautiful clothes launches some new trend in fashion. All of us are indebted to the talent, imagination and research that go into the designing of costumes for motion pictures. Thank you, Audrey. Or as we Swiss know you, account number 36249054. <laughs> and now to present the award, to present the award, several years ago, a very expectant mother waddled down these aisles to receive her Oscar. For a while, we were all a little nervous that there might be an extra award. Well, today, her little boy is eight years old, and the Oscar she received for her lyric performance in On the Waterfront is just a few weeks older. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Eva Marie Saint. Frank, we have a little girl too, but she was born during the Academy off season. Gee, thanks. That saved us all a lot of suspense. <laughs> black and white costume design. For the best costume design in black and white, we will show you the designer sketches. And the nominees are Don Fell for Days of Wine and Roses. Edith Head for the man who shot Liberty Valen. Ruth Morley, the miracle worker. Jenny Vaclioni for Phaedra. And the winner is... Norma Coke for Whatever Happened to Baby Jane. <laughs> deepest appreciation to Robert Aldridge and all the baby chains wherever you are. The nominees for costume design of a color picture are Bill Thomas for Bon Voyage, Maury Kelly for Gypsy, Dorothy Jenkins for Meredith Wilson's The Music Man. Mary Wills for the wonderful world of the Brothers Grimm. And the winner for best costume design of a color picture is... Thank you, Mr. Miller. Mary Wills for the wonderful world of the Brothers Grimm. <laughs> Thank you very much.